Center might be without their home court for a few more weeks. Flooding destroyed the volleyball team's court over the weekend. KMU 8's Ethan Ehlers is live at the Hearn Center with more on what happened and what's ahead for the volleyball program. Ethan? Well, the volleyball court behind me is dry right now as we speak, but that wasn't the case this weekend. Early Saturday morning, a water main broke, and although crews have cleared up all the water from inside the Hearn Center, the university is still adding up all the damages. The deputy athletic director told me a new court will cost more than $100,000. And now the volleyball team actually practices on the Hearn Center court every single day, but has had to find a new place to do so. What we've done for practice is we own our own sport court system, so we're able to set that up over in the, uh, on the track side so they can continue to practice and work out uh, in there. We've begun tearing up the floor in, in two of the corners you can see behind me, in the southeast corner and in the northwest corner. I also asked Joe what some alternatives would be if the court isn't ready for the volleyball team's next home match on October 5th against South Carolina, but he declined to comment until the university has assessed all of the damages. Reporting live in Columbia, Ethan Ehlers, KMU 8 News.